A new report from SC Housing shows thousands of people who live in rental homes need assistance in Greenville. 7 News reporter Olivia Parsons has the latest information on how the county may have help available. Greenville County has nearly $14 million waiting to be distributed to renters in need of assistance. And if you've been impacted by the pandemic, you might want to see if you qualify. According to a new report from SC Housing, more than 40,000 renters in Greenville could meet the criteria to qualify for renters assistance. Brian Grady is SC Housing's chief research officer. He says it's now a matter of spreading awareness. This is designed to be a, the start of a conversation in many ways to try to get people to, to look at these issues um, at the community level and say, are, are we doing what we should be doing? He says the most important audience in many ways is local governments. Because they're the ones who, um, you know, decide about zoning rules. They're the ones who talk about land use policy. They're the ones who make those decisions about how much housing is built. Right now, Greenville County is offering that through their emergency rental assistance program. Bob Mahalik, governmental affairs coordinator for Greenville County, says it's a federal program. But we are responsible for more than $15 million worth of emergency rental and utility assistance money. He says they're in the process of accepting applications now. And the goal is to make sure that nobody loses their home, nobody gets evicted, and everybody has shelter during the COVID pandemic. To qualify, you have to make less than 80% of the area median income. For a single person, that's roughly $42,000. A family of four, that's roughly $60,000. But there are other criteria. And the number one most important criteria is that it is COVID related. And it has to be COVID related financial hardship. Could be due to unemployment, could be due to underemployment. You also have to be in danger of facing eviction or losing your shelter. The assistance is based on need. There will be an evaluation of the application to determine. And it could go back in arrears as much as eight to 10 months. But can also help you with rent up to three three months in advance. So we have a lot of money to give away. The federal government wants to get this out in the community. We want to get it out into the community, but you have to apply. If you're in need of renters assistance and you want to apply, we have a direct link for you to do so up on our website at WSPA.com. Reporting in downtown Greenville, Olivia Parsons, 7 News. You know, aside from the, the rental assistance, the county also has separate money available to hand out for utility assistance. If you need help with that, head to WSPA.com. As Olivia was just saying, there's a link there to the application.